Mitchell wasn't sure what to do after high school, but now his career gives his life a purpose. He also feels that autism actually helps him on his job because he's more detail-oriented than many other people. I know that I would not be a storyteller today if it weren't for my disability. Are there positive things that your disability provides for you? Hello, my name is Mitchell. I work full-time as a sterile processing technician over at Abbott Northwestern Hospital. We're basically the ones who are responsible for cleaning, assembling, and sterilizing instruments that are used in a surgery, making sure they're safe to use. You'd be amazed by how something that feels like a curse can actually be the opposite when you use it in the workforce. I'm able to assemble stuff quickly. I'm able to tell very quickly whether something is dirty or whether it's safe to use and whatnot. I'm able to count like how much of what is needed for a set of instruments and everything. One thing making my life better thanks to working is just having the sense that I'm doing something good. It makes me feel like I have purpose in life. I was one of those people in high school who, when it was over, didn't really have the best idea of what to do after graduating. I always had interests deep down in the healthcare field. I went to a college at Anoka Technical College. I originally started off taking general classes such as general and abnormal psychology, lifespan development, medical terminology, anatomy and physiology, and biology. When I was in college, I did have a, a guidance counselor on hand if I ever needed help while I was there. If there was material I didn't understand, just to ask questions in hopes that they understood it more. It was very helpful, actually. I had help with, with uh, other counselors who uh, helped me with job interviewing and whatnot and the skills needed for doing so. If it wasn't for the help I got for them with how to apply for jobs and everything, then it would have been a little bit more harder because I'm one of those people who doesn't understand the ins and outs of applying for things and whatnot, even though it probably is simple, but you have questions along the way. The most common fear I think for most people is when you walk through that door for the first time and you've never had experience in that field before, the first one is simply, I've never done this before, can I do it? And these people, I've never met them before, they're gonna be ones I can get along with. Just step through that door and you start working and then you'd be surprised, I think, by how quickly you can uh, find yourself into a good position if it's really meant for you. Mitchell always felt drawn to healthcare and pursued those interests in his post-secondary education. Those interests paid off, and he found a job that was just the right fit. He encourages others to find that right job and to work through those first day on the job fears as he did. You'd be surprised how quickly you can find yourself in a good position if it's meant for you. Mitchell also used on-campus support services that were really helpful to him there. There are disability supports on all college campuses. Seek them out if you might need extra help to be successful. Thank you, Mitchell.